start out of business, I gotta fly my people Way too many fakes in my face, I can see the evils Drug addictions, bad bitches, they gotta be jokes See the Pico, black flags, it's all What's good, yo, we back, RTTV What's good, yo, we back, RTTV yeah, 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 yeah. And we are here again To march through with our military And take off oh, With his hand Off RTT Cup you know, RTT cup. cup, huh? RTT, 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 RTT cup. cup, you feel me? Filled it with that Kit Kat ice cream. Y'all ain't tried this yet? Try this, but then try the Twix ice cream. Let us know which one. And then better. try the Oreo ice cream. Try nah, don't put them on, yo. That's like, I don't even like ice cream. Either. And try running yeah. after because there's so many calories. Yeah, I'm good to check. But you know what we That's do love? Calorie. We love that Game of Thrones, though. This we, love shit we, don't. we love that shit. All right. yeah. Uh-huh, we on season three, episode five. Mm -hmm. Before we get to it, if it's your first time here, click that subscribe button. Click that right yeah, now. Subscribe. And if you're not part of Patreon family, well we have another incentive oh, that you may want you know want to join in because we have a bundled up package of the Patreon with the RTTV merch, with the early reactions, with the full reactions. That's all you're right. It's all you're Dog, right. it can't be. It's the only place to be. Yeah. Be on Patreon right now, but also make sure that that notification bell is ringing so every time we drop a video here, y'all know about it first. Gotcha. And if you want a shout out from Evan, just DM him. Yeah. Then you get yeah. Shout out. DM himself free shout outs. Mm. All day. That's what we do. Mm. So we got Jamie Lannister. Mm. We know him. And no like, dying and shit. Rolling his shit. Rolling his shit. Rolling, rolling, shit. Rolling, we dying, 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 we dying. We got Stannis Baratheon tripping off with the red lady. Oh, yeah. We got my boy Davos in the, in the, in the dungeon. Oh, dungeon. man. Yeah. My boy tried to come through and try to snap him off yeah. that, that witchery spell, man, but he's, he's tying the, the pussy grip. That's how whip Pat be when he's in a relationship. Actually, no. And then Before. we got the Hound versus, I always forget his name. Clicking? Oh, yeah. No, the eye patch, yeah, the eye patch, man. Eye patch, man, I like that. Yeah. Let's call him Sinbad. He's not Sinbad. They're about to shoot the fair one. Yeah. And it's a, it's a um, trial by combat. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's a fight to the death. Exactly. And then we also have, uh, what you call it, Marjorie doing her finesse moves and using kindness to kill her enemies. She's puppeteering Jock. Oh, yeah, Queen she's Terrell. out here like this. Queen oh, Terrell and Gma. Oh, you like the dangerous stuff? Robbie's not the only puppeteer. Queen, Queen Terrell and Gma. No, puppeteer. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Master Tear. Yeah, Master Tear. Oh! Master Tear. Emma Wachan Danny, yo. Oh, Emma Wachan Danny. She did that. She did, did that. that. Mm -hmm. She said, here's my dragon. <laughs> Jakaris, come back. <laughs> And then she just fucked everybody up. Yeah, basically. Mm -hmm. basically. I knew it. I knew it. And she walked out with 8,000 soldiers. Yeah. And he's in the city moving slow. And all three dragons. And all three dragons. Yeah, I love it. And dragons. I want, I forgot how to pronounce her name, bro. Which one? That beautiful caramel skin, curly hair woman. Oh, that I don't know her name either. She's, she's a slave. Bad. I don't think she, she has a name. She has a name. Oh, yeah, but I don't think she said her name yet. Does she? I don't think she did yet. It's like messing yeah. up. <coughs> Some, something like with an M. You could tell she got something to prove. Nah, Melisandre's name? Melisandre is the red woman. Nah. Okay, then I got Miss Screwed. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, that's I'm yeah. So I forgot her name, but yeah. Her. She's amazing. <laughs> Let's find out what happens in the next episode of Game of Thrones! Kiss my Shit is not, that was lit. That blood sent that fire off, like that shit lit. Bro, you know he's getting fired. You think he did that on purpose? Hell yeah. He's going for fight with Oh, he got the howl in the fire. Oh, oh. 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 Dude, he sliced right through his arm. Die from that. Oh. Can you see how deep he got into his arm? Not today. What the fuck? Hold <laughs> up, oh, <no>, dude. <laughs> this. Yo, that guy had whispered some stuff. Man, his arm. Uh, Remember, he was like, yo, come back. He says it. His lights are being told. Oh, there he go, that John Snow. Snow. That's my nigga right there. A thousand liar. Hello. What happens to your eagle after I kill you? 
What up? Let him know. Was he just flop dead to the ground? He's no crow. Just because you want him in so I like you, boy. But if you lie to me, I'll pull your guts out through your throat. No game of thrones, they really would do that. Mm. A thousand men. She said he's still a crow. Oh, she wants it. Yo, let's see if you really a crow. Why are you still trash? You know nothing, Jones. You know nothing. You know nothing. Oh, ha! You know that, though. Yeah. Yeah. That's a fire ass place to have sex, yo. Nothing you did with your mouth. So, what was you to that lady's in the south? I don't know. I just wanted to kiss you there, is all. <laughs> Thank you. Very good then. That's she's she's really a boss. She's really a boss, bro. She means that uh, like, ah, right, right, you want fucking money, man? All right, all right, right, we got it. We got it. I'm going to stay on Smith for the brotherhood. Lord, oh. Have you lost your mind? I'm going to find this place. You think I'm spared the Smiths? Never had a family. I heard her right there. I can be your family. I knew that's oh. exactly what she was thinking. Oh, is this a rescue? Oh, 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 I saw Harry and I on the battlefield, and Torrin was strangled by the Kingslayer. The king who lost the north. Oh, shit. Well. The Scott Lord cast out to the dungeon. Hang the rest of them. Mercy, sire! I didn't kill anyone! I only watched for the guards! This one was only the watcher. Hang him last so he can watch the others die. Oh, oh my god. god! You need to cast out the men to end it. Spare his life. Keep him as a hostage. A hostage. You are no king of mine. Oh. Yo. Oh. 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 Nah, he's a wild one, dude. I feel like with that blow right there, he just lost the one. Turn this blue one turn against him. Yeah. Your brother said that. I'll make a contribution to our cause. But you can go. Nice. A hostage. Are you selling me? Don't think of it that way. Toros? How many times have you brought me back? It's the Lord of Light brings you back. I'm just the lucky drunk who says the words. How <laughs> many times? Five, I think. Well, this makes sense. Could you bring back a man without a head? Not six times. Just once. Oh. I don't think it works that way, child. Fuck. Chris. 
Exactly. That's a ride or die. You find out that your husband cheated, or you start being but happy. She's trying shit. to say she's looking for. Whoa! Them. What the fuck is that? My sweet boy. That bitch is crazy, nigga. That's what that's it is. all of her. Anyone who was against him before long half the country was against him came to the king backing him to surrender. He told me to bring him my father's head. Then he turned to his pyramids and them all. Commanded you to kill your own father and stand by while thousands of men, women, and children burned alive. Would you have done it? Exactly. Yeah. Jamie. You kept your oath then. Let's see. He's a good boy. Yeah, yeah his guy. perspective of that, we actually heard the story. Yeah, he's just little kids, though. I'm a fuck. If you were you think you're a traitor. Are you? I am, Jack. I disobeyed my king, your father, and now I'm paying the price. Even if he's serving a drunk or a lunatic, there's once in my life before it's over. I want to know what it's like to serve with pride. Damn it. Do you believe in her? Yeah. With all my heart. With all my heart. What the fuck? Pat watches. Pat watches. Oh, I've yeah, never yeah, seen yeah, this in my life. Hey, that was quick. Ooh, that put direction on your ass. She's stupid, bitch. 
She was like, oh yeah, Daria, you gotta do this. Nah, you gotta do even worse. Yeah. Oh, this is the best. This episode was crazy, bro. This episode this was episode, fucking crazy. Bro, you know what's mad funny? The, the, um, Tyrion's girl was like, why you like Sandy? Yeah, yeah. That's why I'm like, oh, bro, yeah. bro, and nigga. And now you're married her? <laughs> bro, oh, nigga. God. Imagine trying to tell like a grown, like a grown man telling his girl, like, why you marry another girl? Cause my, my dad, dad told me. Shay, Shay, about to punch him in. Yeah, if we ever, ever get Kobe, one of your girls just be like, your dad told you. Your dad told me to marry her. My dad said I gotta marry her, yo. I'm sorry, yeah, my dad. Nah, that's not right. Damn, that's really that scene was really fucking crazy, yo. Cause, yo, fucking. Cersei walked in that shit like, oh yeah, you know what? I know it's about to happen. You're gonna have to marry this girl and shit like that. She did not see her fucking part coming at all, nigga. And I love that so much, yo. You thought you had the upper hand against your brother? Nah, psych, yo. You gotta go marry this Tyrell. But yo, you gotta pay attention to my boy's little finger. Little finger. Little, little finger genius. Pulling some strings. Nah, he's nigga. genius. He's playing the game of chess perfectly. Yo, right I feel now. like Game of Thrones tactics is amazing. Yeah. He like he had Lord Tywin. The information he gives Tywin Lannister, bro, he's like the perfect spy. Yeah. Cause you see, like he's the one that hooked up. Uh, who who got the Tyrells on to side more, to dude. protect the fuck King's Landing? Yeah. And now he found out about. Um, the whole plot with the uh, Marjorie trying to get Tyrell to marry. Yeah. Or well, not Tyrell. Um, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Lords to marry Lord, Sansa, yeah. and he told obviously he told um, Tywin. Yeah. And then. That blew up because now he's marrying. Yeah, that's for Tyrion and, and Queen. It's all part of his plan, you know? He's a gangster. Little this thing. is this is crazy. What I wanna know is how the fuck is Rob Stark? Wow, fuck him. How the fuck Watch is him Rob Stark? Wait, wait, wait. Stark wait, wait, before we get there, the before we get there. Dead. Before we get there. Cause I don't wanna leave this topic without asking this question. Um, since it was Peter's like first idea to marry Sansa, so he shifted the whole uh, like idea to go to for for Sansa to marry Tyrion. She well she switched she you know switched the, she switched the initial shit because she remember he was like yeah you coming with me and she was like I'm mm, yeah, yeah. not right now brother exactly. and yeah. that blew up his plan so he's like all right cool I'm if gonna I, I'm yeah. gonna snitch if I can have her no way oh no, okay right. Right. I'm gonna yeah. fuck her whole shit up yeah. and make. And he told Tyler. Damn, little finger. Damn. Damn. I feel like, too. Sansa is definitely like, it's one of those situations where she's becoming confident and she's like, believes in the um, Tyrells. But she's in for a rude, rude awakening where when she hears that news, like, I want to see her reaction. Like, seriously. Yeah. It's one of those situations, like, they're still fucking with me. Fuck. Like, yeah. Like, it's like, everyone thought they were good until now. Nah, the dad came in and said, yo, I'm going to correct everything. We're going to fix that. And, yeah, that. and, and the way that he even is... says, oh, we're going to put an end to that dirty rumor of her and her brother. Yeah. It's like, it's like, I had, like, pretty much, she, we felt like she had so much, she had more power when the, the king was alive. Like, she was way more powerful. Oh, yeah. Hell now, yeah. It's like, we seen her go from being so strong and her e using her power to, like, yo, kill them, da da da. To now, like, you have, you're have going to marry another person again. Like, you're going through it all over again, and you don't have no choice at your age, how old you are. And it's really crazy, too, because, like, as, like, the father, like, tends to expose, um, tends to expose Cersei. Um, because it's like, Yo, he's like, yo, you're not as smart as you think. And this goes to show she's really not as smart as she thinks. Like, realistically, in that situation where you would think that, like, you would think that, all right, we obviously want all the pieces to be in our favor. So you think that it's like, it's like you should know going to that, well, if he's going to marry her, if you're, if I'm making um, Tyrion marry Sansa, then you got to marry um, the other dude I forgot his name. You got you got to you got to marry Laura so we can have all pieces in the puzzle, right? Don't and then try to be a smart ass about it because she tries to put she's putting herself in situations she's putting herself in situations where she just wants to be a smart ass and thinks she has a one up on oh, on Tyrion yeah. on, on, on 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 everybody and she's just taking L's significantly because she's not thinking she's not plotting properly like she's not good like she doesn't do this. A prediction I think uh, her and um, Tyrion are gonna team up to take down their dad. 
Like I think that I think the dad put they realize both of them ain't each other's real enemy. Like yeah, his real threat is the dad. Cause even think about the dad too. The dad could really dead um things girl. Turning his girl like yeah. he did with it before. Easily. And yeah, it's sure. like his sister can't dead his girl. Like he knows that. Like his sister's but not a like threat. You you can't kill. Uh, Time on Lannister yeah. only because he's the leader of the army. Exactly. You feel, you feel so at that point, they no, but they're not. I mean, they're against him. I don't know they're gonna kill him or whatever. But and Cersei, I'm just thinking about it. Cersei's really, truly, sincerely tapped in the head. She tried to kill her brother. She's gonna she do a three. Try to kill her brother and she fucks her other brother. Like I'm telling you, it was the wild, wild west until Tywin Lannister came. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like, it was really like everybody yeah. firing at the hip. Fuck it, we're all going hard. Now he came. He was like. You sit your stupid ass the fuck down. Yeah. You two, this how we're gonna but go. I kind of like it though. I, I like. Nah. He's one of the evil villains I like. Like he's lit. He, nah, he's definitely. He's he definitely king. has. Yeah. He has he's a moral. He really is a real His moral king, is Lannister over everything. If if it's for the Lannisters, I'll do whatever. And it's like yeah. Yeah, yeah, you don't care about nothing else. It's like yo, I don't care. It's like uh, remember when uh, Daenerys Stormborn's uh, brother said. I let you get raped by a thousand people in it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yo, he's like that times 30. Like, <laughs> I let them do whatever the fuck we gotta do. As long as this last the name keeps going. You're fertile. You got another baby. Yeah, right? Yeah. 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 You're fertile yeah. too. You still better be, be having babies. Oh, the thing is, is, technically shit. speaking, what everything he said in terms of maintaining their fucking iron hand. It's right it's the right move. Good move. Yeah. Terry, yeah. like the low right. key. That like it it's was a cover. <laughs> That's a cover. Oh, no, nah, in, in a different world, Tyrion's. Oh, no, but I feel shit. like I feel like his dad really feels like yo, my nigga. I'm help like yeah, like bro. Like, I feel like he really feels like yo, I put you on. Like, because he doesn't, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. He because doesn't his dad Shay. doesn't know he does. His dad doesn't know about Shay. Yeah. Shay. Well, he does. He's absolutely right. But he Shay doesn't, doesn't come with anything. Though, nah. Like Shay doesn't come with a name, a house. A, like power, it doesn't matter to you. You feel me? And Terry was asking for that. Yeah, that y'all should be rewarded for you know what I'm saying protecting. Yeah. So, <laughs> like, hey, so you want that? Oh, hey, you are here. Lord of Winterfell, my nigga. <laughs> yeah, it's like yeah, you got it. You'll be Lord of Winterfell. Alright, yeah, no bullshit. And now, Jerry, you can go right into the Rob this conversation. Is fucking fuck Rob. Stop. Yo, fuck How you. How the fuck oh, is he about? To pull this shit off, he's not because he's go. logically, yeah, logically, it doesn't. This doesn't look good. It's like I, right, you lost, you um, you lost half of your army because you killed somebody who, that's in in perspective, like I, right, like he wasn't in the right for killing those children, right? And he wilded out. But it's like you lost half your army because you killed him. You actually needed that dude. That was actually a piece. That was actually a big piece into your army, right? Mm-hmm. One. Two, it's like you're over here trying to think that you could get men, an army from a man that you were supposed to marry his, that you were supposed to marry his daughters, and lo and behold, the dumbest shot you have a wife. Mm-hmm. So you're gonna go there with your wife and be like, all right, yeah. So I need an army. Um, yeah. No, but, yeah. The way he says it's like, oh, all I gotta do is mm-hmm. yeah. roll a twin, talk to Walter Frey. Right? The man that yeah, yeah, like, I was supposed to marry his daughter. I'm like, all right, my nigga. That yeah, makes and sense. And you saw her face too. She was like, yo, if we're giving anybody the benefit of the doubt, though, I feel like, yo, talk about hard situations, bro. I get forced to lead a fucking war. Like, Yo, Rob's in a tough situation, and the only reason that nah, his, the only reason that he took an nah, L bro. is because he didn't kill his mom. Nah, bro. Bro, nah. at the end of the day, it was either kill your mom and keep all your all your army, or nah, don't bro. kill your mom Yo, and bro, lose that respect. Bro, bro, you gotta he took that L on that respect. Nah, the thing everybody gotta understand. What is he gonna war? do? It's war. Everything ain't gonna happen naturally. Like war is casualties all the time and stuff. Stuff like that. My whole situation is you have to do what's right for the people. In that situation, at the end of the day, we're not condoning anyone killing kids. At all, but this guy's got his kids killed. In his mind, it was the right thing. Still, no. Killing but Tambo, the first good. issue was that he didn't kill his mom, though. So if that's your argument, no, 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 it's Jamie. He, didn't let him get, yeah, it's Jamie. he yeah. wanted to kill Jamie first, and then she let the. But he didn't wild out about that. He was yeah. chilling. No, he but, wild out no, when no, she no, let him go. Was different. No. One was different. No, but she let him go. I feel like I feel like one is they let him go. They didn't kill him. That's different. They kill these niggas. Like it's no like it's no like at least they getting Jamie back. Like it's ways you could get shit back. This niggas kids is dead. That that leverage you had, whatever that's they're dead. Like it's gone. Like 
that's worse. And that's why I'm, and I feel like he shouldn't have killed him though. Cause it wasn't good for the people. When you're at war, you're trying to defend it. Whoever, you gotta do what's good for the people. People told him, his, he asked for his advice. Everyone was like, yo, don't do it. Cause you're gonna lose your army. Yeah. You gotta do strategize so you could take over. He did everything based off emotions, how Rob felt. I'm yeah. king of the north. No, yeah. watch you coming at me. Like it was so pro like it was so macho man, like it was like, yo, like I lost a lot. I think I lost, I lost like, all respect. Kid. I lost all the respect. Kid. Yo, and it's Unreal. Like, he's gonna like I don't like John's I think John Snow's just gonna come through and save him. Like, I don't think he's gonna die. I think John Snow's gonna come through and probably take over with his squad. John so, Snow's a real Rob, guy, I think man. Rob the, John the leadership. Very far away, my nigga. Yeah, yeah, very no, far. I know, I'm just saying, like, bro, really? like, I feel like the tag team, I feel like them two together, they're gonna fuck shit up, man, when they link. Nah, but John Snow, he's a real one. Yeah, the conversation Snow that he was having with that. that dude, and then he took the wood and then he threw it on the ground and was like, all right, so do you need to catch his fate? Yeah. Like, like, do you need to, you think I'm lying? It's he's like, he's like, you're lying. He's like, yeah. Yeah, this episode, he really had to prove to everybody he's with that he's no longer. Yeah. You know, yeah. a crow. That's why he had to fuck homegirl. Because, mm. you know what I'm saying, he had vows as a, as a, a man of black not to, yeah. you know what I'm saying, have sexual relations with women and stuff. And then um, he also had to tell them, like, how many people were held at uh, the wall, yeah. how many castles there were, you know yeah. what I'm saying, all these information so that they can penetrate and attack. Yeah, so, that's why like, they was really looking at him like, yo, bro, we fuck with you, but it's like, we, we're not going to hesitate to kill you if you're bullshit. Yeah. And the Night's like, Watch, day, the Night's Watch is all fucked up right now. Oh wait, no, they dismantled. Dude, they're they're so dismantled right now. Oh, we so still didn't see what happened. With yeah. That, yeah, it's like we've seen that freaking. Um, I was Charlie. Same I was gonna Charlie. say Charlie. I was Charlie. Charlie. Charlie really escaped the shorty, yo. He said, "No, let's run off." We need to go right now. <laughs> you know, I think the first time he ever raised his voice. Gonna, uh, well, I'll say that for predictions, but like, um, even like Khaleesi, I like the fact that she's given like her people. Like freedom now too, mm -hmm. um, and telling them, listen, you guys are free to have, you guys are free to have your, your names, own names, yeah. like, be free, like you know what I'm saying? Cause she like she's so dope because she sees tomfoolery and fuckery, and she's not for tomfoolery and fuckery. You know what I'm saying? Like, she was moved when he when uh, when homie said that though. Yeah, it's like nah, this this name represents when I'm like. When I was when I became free when From you came, when you answered the whole government, nigga. Mm -hmm. So it's like. That right there was a, a defining moment, not for just for her men that's following her, but for herself. She's noticing the impact that she has on the men that's like now becoming a part of her army and stuff like that. Yeah. So it goes a long way when it comes to her leading and for her men following and shit like that. And then we also have the interaction between uh, Jorah, 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 Jorah. Jorah. Get it in the kitchen and then, um, and the freaking ex commander and stuff like that. So it's like that interaction is dope because it's like you see how the commanders talk about, like, yo, I never had an opportunity to actually like fight with pride with a person that I'm actually like working under. I had to do deal with a drunk and I had to deal with a mad king, mm -hmm. and now I feel like I found a person that, like, you know, I actually could rock with. And then this thing like, draw is like, remind him, like, yo, bro, remember, like. You're not a commander in this situation. Like we're both. Well, the reason to he Khaleesi. said, that, yeah, the reason he said that was like, yo, he, he was like, well, if you guys take, if Khaleesi takes the army to Westeros, mm. you were, you know, yeah. casted out of Westeros. Your name was fucking yeah, tarnished. So there. You probably shouldn't be next to her. Mm -hmm. He's like, well, my nigga, like, you don't mean shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This ain't Westeros, my nigga. Yeah, this ain't Westeros. You just joined yourself. a few days yeah. ago. Yeah, no bullshit. Yeah. Like the nigga that just popped up now was trying to tell me what I should do. They yeah. fuck out my face, yo. Well, I'm really happy for her, man, but, yo, Rob, man, real shit, everything crumbled once he married Shorty, bro. Nah. And that's what I don't think. I don't think, I don't think that that Lord necessarily, Kostak told him he said, you lost this war when you married yeah. her. Yeah. But I don't really think that he lost the war because, once he did this. I don't yeah. think, honestly, none of that he was good. Yo, think about uh, um, Lannister, uh, Tywin Lannister, like, he pretty, pretty much like, yo, he's chopped. He lost yeah. them, yeah. Uh, Sans is the next up, but we don't gotta worry about him. Like, he killed himself. Like, it's pretty much like he already looked at it like, yo, he's done, bro. Like, that move he did, like, that's the first time he completely ran him off. Like, and yeah. I feel like that him marrying that girl, nobody cares. That's not gonna hurt nothing. But you being your emotions and killing someone that had it meant to fight for you, like, nah, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, it's a certain stuff. And it's only because he wanted his vengeance and your mom 
the Lamb Gears Ventures for the kids he lost. Yeah, you feel me? That was real shit. All this yeah, never, all, and the crazy thing is that none of this would have happened if his mom didn't release fucking, fucking Jimmy. Yeah, you, know, so you, know, you know, I retract that whole situation. Oh, Why? Because the thing is, right, Jamie would have died that night. Yeah. Without a doubt, Jamie would have died that night. And that would have that would have took her out, took out every bit of leverage they even had to even get Sans and Arya back. They should have killed that the nigga. Killed that start. Fuck honestly, the, the only one that would have been in trouble is Sansa. Yeah, because I don't, Arya, I don't even think they would have killed her because yeah, killed she's still the key to the north. Yeah. True. You feel me? So yeah, they don't have Arya. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So they were just really playing it safe. Um, and that gets me gets gets me to my point with Jamie too. We see him. He gets captured by Roose Bolton, mm-hmm. but he's not kind of like a, you know what I'm saying? He, They're not he, training him like Yeah, he yeah. got a shower, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? He got That's his fucking tough. arm treated. Ten, treated and yeah. so what, are you, what are your thoughts on that? I think that, like, the, the beside the fact of him pushing um, home right. off the... Off the um, off the building because that shit that shit so wasn't cool. I think nah, that I think that he's not as terrible as like it's portrayed to him like nah, in, in the in the first seasons. He still he still did he still done some fuck shit, but it's oh, still yeah, like Stark. it's like it's like even with the Ned Stark shit when he him and Ned Stark were fighting and then the dude went and stabbed him and then nah, Jamie got jumped out. He, he killed all Ned Stark's men. Nigga, you niggas don't even remember. You niggas really be thinking Jamie is a nice nigga. You remember he it's came in. He's a nice nigga. Bodied. Like, he bodied. He killed he, all this nigga's that's, that's men. That's a battle. They wasn't in battle. They wasn't in battle. They wasn't in battle. They wasn't in war. They wasn't in battle. They wasn't in war. They wasn't in war. They wasn't in war. You gotta understand. You gotta understand. You gotta understand why. Fuck Ned Stark too. While we at it, he's the bad guy. You gotta understand why. Mr. Perspective, man. This nigga's not like Mr. Rob, nigga. That's always on the perspective of the opposite side. You're not gonna understand the perspective of Jamie. How can I understand Jamie? Jamie pushed the nigga's son. Then you killed all his men. Like this nigga was like, what are you guys talking about? He. Puts his son first, then he bite all the niggas back. And I, Why I, did he kill him though? Why the information Ned had but could have started, started a war between from, his family and the Crown, my. But nigga. what his family, him and his sisters, so him and we feel we feel sympathy for him and his sister. But you feel so sympathy with Lord Carstock, the one that got killed by Rob. You f- how you feel sympathy for him and he killed two kids but you can't feel it. Yeah, it's like no, doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. I said feel sympathy. I said that. I get uh, his point of view. Like I'm not saying you know, I even said I, 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 wait, wait. Did I not say don't kill kids? So I wouldn't even do what he did. I'm just saying okay, maybe if you that mad, I could get what could push you to do that. That don't mean it's right. But I just said not to kill him because he has an army. I didn't say it's the right thing to do. I'm just saying when in war, you have to do what's right for the people. Yeah, but it's right to kill him. Rob was right. It's right to kill him. But right now, you need his niggas, so it's not the smart move for to Jamie do. to protect his family. He had to do that. But J- Jamie and them tried to, they killed uh, the kings right here before Ned Stark even came here. So they was already plotting on some crazy shit. You remember the, 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 the But they killed, they killed uh, the former hand because he found out about Jamie Lannister <laughs> and, uh, and Cersei. That's fucking, they, they were already doing fuck. he was cheating, he was cheating well, with the king's wife, what he queen. shouldn't be doing. Yeah. So, Alfred, why am I still feeling bad, guys? It is his sister, guys, come on. Like, you guys, come like, on. your case it's for this guy is really like, yeah. you know, it's all about so, the oh, so it's, it's all right about that he's fucking his sister? It's Even his dad right. looked at him and said, no, what's good not, with you, nigga? Like, right. his, his, um, his incest baby, we're not sure if it's confirmed yet. Oh, uh, that's 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 oh my fault. Yeah, whatever. His incest baby even said to his mom, "Disgusting." Like guys, this guy's already been on a fucked up trail. He pushed a little kid off, killed this nigga's man just because he wants to fuck his his sister. Come on. But it's I'm an really important, it's an important dialogue that Jamie had with Brienne regarding the situation that's with fine, the Mad King and shit. That 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 that's what I'm trying to say. Guy. I'm really saying, regardless of anything, like obviously it's like. All that situation, all those, everything that you say is right regardless of the fact that, like, none of that shit would happen if he wasn't fucking his sister. Regardless yeah. of anything. We can't, I won't, I won't condone that. I'm it saying. off of that one nasty act. Exactly. That nasty act just trickled off to all a bunch of chain reactions of you doing fuckery and have to kill people, kill people, kill people. Mm-hmm. But the initial, like, origin of motherfucking Jamie, motherfucking Kingslayer Lannister was built off of. 
honor. Realistically, it's like that. It's really the fact it's that it's honor like, fucking the king. Yo, my he nigga, you're talking about queen. two different things. I'm talking about. I'm talking about the he fact he killed the mad king, king yeah. for a purpose because of the fact that the nigga was really just on like a killing spree, nigga. He was just on some shit that yo burn everybody. Yo, matter of fact, kill your dad and bring that nigga, bring that nigga's head to me and shit like that. Yeah, and it's true. like. Yo, I'm not gonna sit here and watch innocent people get bodied and shit like that, and then and then just be honored, on, like doing the honorable thing and standing by the king, whatever he says. Like, so it's like I respect that aspect of Jamie right there, and I think but that was, was more dialogue. Based, was it more based off the fact that he even mentioned the nigga's dad? Like that's what I'm saying. It's nah, nah, because he said it too. He said there was a whole bunch of wildfire underneath the city. Yeah. They said to explode. You know what I'm saying? So it would have killed a whole bunch of people. Yeah, no, 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 I'm saying it would have killed people, but then he say, this nigga told me to kill my dad. Like, how am I gonna kill my dad? Like, wasn't and that, the, wasn't that, wait, wasn't was that, that wait, but wasn't that the pushing point of his dad saying, yo, you want me to kill my dad? Is like, you're crazy. Like, he pretty much was doing it prior to that. It's just, yo, you want me to kill even more people and my dad? It's like, nah, this nigga got me fucked up. Like, I'm gonna kill you. You want me to kill? So my whole point, Jamie, that's just, you just put my point of strong Jamie being Hold on, prior to that though, prior to him saying um, he killed my dad, remember he went up to he went up to <laughs> he went up to the king and he said, "Yo, I begged the king to surrender." surrender. Yeah. And then he Multiple said, times. "Then the Multiple king times. said." Multiple times. Yeah. Then the king said. Yeah. Then the king said, "Yo, matter of fact, bring me your dad's head." Yeah. That's what that yeah, was. Yeah, yeah, that's my point. Yeah, that's that's, that's the whole. Line. That's exactly what I'm. That's my point. But his he dad did. was the pushing point. Nah. He, yes, he is. So he said, he, I, he said, yo, and I... And then he said, he, and then he told the Meister, he said, then he told the Meister, let it burn. Like, Wait, let, but let, you, you guys just said he begged the king when he said a few to times do that. Before that yeah. he, but he begged him, and then he said, you know what? You're begging me. Your dad, too. That like, was great. the pushing point. Like I said, I feel you. It was I, part his, of it, but it was more to it. But feel, Thousands of people would have died. I feel you, that. but if he didn't say his dad's part, he might not. We don't know where it could have went. Yeah, you, you really know what I'm don't fuck with Jamie. That shit's I, crazy. You <laughs> him, you <laughs> kid, he killed an honorable like, man's dad. Yeah, like, my whole thing was like, no, no I can't, because it's not comparable to the mom. Like, I understand the mom. The mom didn't kill nobody. The mom didn't push. She let a nigga free. This nigga actually made a little kid paralyzed, killed a good man's people, and my whole point is like, we end the world. So does just because you did when you do wrong, just because you did good before, do do does that make up for the wrong? No, it no. Don't. That's I'm my just, whole point with Jamie. I know yeah, that. Jamie I didn't kill the king. So if I mean, Jamie didn't kill the king that day, Ned Stark probably would have been alive. Keep it on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, a lot of people would have yeah, been yeah, alive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Ned Stark ain't alive anyways, regardless. So, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so yeah. I mean, yo, you didn't want that nigga get a couple extra days. This nigga, this nigga, this nigga ain't alive anyways, regardless. My nigga, his son is paralyzed. I mean, it's not like Ned Stark is chilling right now. Like, his family's all scattered. Like, come on, my nigga's like, are we really serious? Nah, like, the picture, the like, like Jamie he's... fucked up this nigga's whole family up since he pushed the little kid. Like, he ruined the the start. Like, and we're just gonna give it because he killed the mad king and he gave his sad story and his hands cut off. Nah, try a little harder. Like, he's still a dickhead, yo. I'm I good. mean, they all did bad stuff. Ned Stark was a soldier. He killed people. So, if you For horrible you reasons, I feel you. Uh -huh. For honorable reasons. Yeah, perception of honorable. No, no, no. It's not honorable. So he's, that stock's not honorable now? So Jamie got you feeling that stock not honorable. Because the thing is, it's like, that's not honorable. Off the base of honor. When he cut that nigga's head off, when he cut that nigga's head off in the beginning of the show and stuff like that. That was off honor. Exactly, but that's your perception of honor. No, that's not mine. He killed me. Yo, he saw a male salty and white walker and shit like that. And he had to walk away from it. So, Pat, so, Pat, do you think that stock's honorable, yes or no? Yeah, I do. So, do. All right. So, so it's all, it's all, it's all our pick. We all think that Stark's honorable, so we don't think everything he does is based off of honor. Yeah, but I said, like right, I said so what are we saying? What because we I said, about? I said that yo, Jamie's. I said Jamie's situation with the Mad King. That was one honorable moment of his life. Okay, I'm not. Well, I'm not going to go into shit. That was in yeah. terms of honor. Yeah, I, think yeah, I don't think Jamie's not honorable. What honor bro. really is because he he was a gold. Um, he was a a king's. Uh, yeah, he was a. Not the cloak. Well, I forget what it's called. The gold cloak. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so he was technically he was protector. He was supposed to protect the king at all costs. Mm -hmm. That's an honor. Basically. You know what I'm saying? But he dishonored himself um, by killing the king, Maybe. but for the greater, for the greater good. Yeah. For honor. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. For honor so to his saying. family, honor to his people. Honor you know to what I'm saying? Family. So that's basically Manage like who, who are you supposed to have honor? Um, who are you supposed to protect first? Your family. But then at the same time too. What is honor? Kind of what Robbie's saying too. 
is like honestly, I like I listen into the conversation that we've had. I'm thinking about it and just thinking about the character of Jamie. Honestly, if all this shit didn't happen to him, to where he's getting humbled, he would still be a dickhead. <laughs> he would still be a dickhead. Like, he's like, like, he's, he's, back he's, be, he's being, he's being, like, he's being, he's being humbled. You don't get. I, I like, still think like the same that mad bullshit. I'm like, saying that one situation. Wow. I respect oh him from that one situation, I mean, but I still think he's a dickhead. You respect that moment. You respect him now. I respect that moment. Like, every yeah, person, that's that's like, every, that's every person has a good and bad, especially in Thrones. I'm saying they like the good and bad. And uh, at that, he was humbled, but that shit that he did uh, when he killed the Mad King that happened right before, he was humbled. Yeah. So he was still a good person. He just did a lot of bad shit because obviously he was fucking his sister. Not a good thing to do. Now maybe he said, Ned Stark, maybe maybe he said why didn't you tell Ned Stark? You said you think Ned Stark would believe me. Why didn't he believe him? Because he was ready to do fuck. He said, you don't think Ned Stark horrible. would care about my story? Yeah, like why, didn't he, why didn't he? Because he was ready to do fucked up shit, guys. That that start oh, getting like no, he killed the king. He killed the king, Rob. No, but and he was, it's no, not about that whole shit from the past. He never had a past. He was a king's guard. So he was a good guy. Like, yeah. What are you talking about? He was a king's guard to kill the king. Yeah, yeah. 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 that's fucking yes. Yeah. And that start. No, no one knew about that. That's why that start is a man who's a honor. He died off of honor. So at the end of the day, that nigga Jamie wasn't honorable. He killed. He didn't do his position. He killed the king. Ned Ned died off honor, but his family is paying the cost. Cause the nigga and then Jamie son. Lannister Cause nigga dishonored himself and his family is alive. Cause the nigga so that's all we gotta say about that. What the fuck, but if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be a last. Nah. Make sure you kill murder and smash, smash. that subscribe button. It's your boy, Wells, Wells Snow. Did Continue watching us. Snow. Yes, sir. Season 3, episode 5. Episode six next. If you want to catch him early before it hits our YouTube, make sure you check out our Patreon. Do that. Subscribe. Full reactions coming Full. your way as well. Stay tuned. You make sure you got that early access. And I go by the name of DC. Follow me on Instagram, DCZ underscore World R T. Yo, shout out to the whole Stark family. Yo, I'm holding it down for the Starks. You heard? Yeah, I'm holding it down for Danny, man. You already know what it is, man. Patrick got to see a load of fabrics, yo. Shout out to Danny. Shout out to the Three Dragons, man. It's Lady out here. He watching us, everything. He the conversations, everything. as always, man. Stay tuned. And this is the king of the camera. The bond, the myth, the legend, Wilkins underscore RT. Shout out to Game of Thrones and this great discussion that we are having, guys. Also, we're going to be having Rick and Morty for episode 5 through 8 coming very soon. Yeah, and check out Rick and Morty because it's the best show ever. Go where Rick and Morty goes. Monsters, madness, mayhem. See, I know my shit. Well, if you push little kids, if you sleep with married women, if you sleep with your sister, if you kill honorable men, we don't fuck with you out here ever. It don't matter what good things you do, you will still a straight bitch ass. Fuck things. Jamie Lannister. Straight all day, fuck Jamie Lannister. Bitch. No sympathy all here all day, yo. You already know what it is, Rob Sagat, Prince Media Kid. Yeah, Robbie's gonna, gonna make yeah. a Robbie's gonna make a selfie yeah. Instagram yeah. video pretty much talking shit to Jamie Lannister. Like, yo, fuck that nigga Jamie Lannister. Yo, Rob Stark too, you can so that sells it at the round table. What's good, yo? If it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you click that subscribe button. It's the Haitian Prince Rob City RT. And you're now rocking with RT TV or Disney. <laughs> 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 <laughs>